Glands, a gland is a collection of cells which has the power of separating from the blood a special substance. A glands may be either secreting or excreting. The secreting glands prepare useful material required in the further work of the body. The excreting glands separate waste materials from the blood for their immediate removal. Types of glands, there are two types of glands. Endocrine glands, ductless, and exocrine glands, duct. Endocrine glands, ductless glands the glands, whose secretions, instead of being carried off by ducts or poured directly into the blood, are known as the ductless glands, and the process is called the internal secretion. The substances produced by such glands are known as the hormones. Although hormones are secreted only in small quantities at a time, they are carried by the blood to distant regions of the body where they stimulate various physiological processes. Thus these glands play an important part in regulating and co-coordinating the functions of different organs of the body without the control of the nervous system. The important ductless or endocrine glands are the major endocrine glands, hypothalamus, pineal gland, thymus, thyroid gland, adrenal gland, pancreas, pituitary gland, testes, ovaries. Hypothalamus, the hypothalamus is a small region of the brain. It's located at the base of the brain, near the pituitary gland and controls endocrine system. The hypothalamus is the main link between endocrine system, and nervous system. It keeps the body in homeostasis as much as possible. Homeostasis means a healthful, balanced bodily state. The body is always trying to achieve this balance. Feelings of hunger, for example, are the brain's ways of letting its owner know that they need more nutrients to achieve homeostasis. It uses information from our nervous system to determine when to tell other glands, including the pituitary gland, to produce hormones. The hypothalamus controls many processes in our body, including food, thirst, memory, body temperature, blood pressure, emotional, sleep, patterns and sexual function. Hypothalamus manages hormones. Hormones are chemical messengers that travel in bloodstream to other part of body. Antidiuretic hormone, vasopressin, which increases how much water is absorbed into the blood by the kidneys. Corticotropin releasing hormone. CRH, which helps regulate metabolism and immune response by working with the pituitary gland and adrenal gland to release certain steroids. Gonadotropin-releasing hormone, GnRH, which instructs the pituitary gland to release more hormones that keep the sexual organs working. Growth hormone-releasing hormone, GHRH, also known as somatostatin, prompts the anterior pituitary to release growth hormone, GH, in children, GH is essential to maintaining a healthy body composition. In adults, it aids healthy bone and muscle mass and affects fat distribution. Oxytocin, a hormone involved in several processes, including the release of a mother's breast milk, moderating body temperature, and regulating sleep cycles. Prolactin controlling hormones, which tell the pituitary gland to either start or stop breast milk production in lactating mothers. Thyrotropin-releasing hormone TRH activates the thyroid, which releases the hormones that regulate metabolism, energy levels, and developmental growth. The pituitary gland, it is called master gland. It is a small pea-sized gland, reddish-gray body situated in the pituitary fossa of the sphenoid bone. It is also called hypophysis which in Greek means lying under. It has two lobes or parts. The front, part, anterior, and back part, posterior. The front part secretes a hormone which regulates the growth and development of the body. If this secretion is produced in excess, the body grows abnormally and a giant of a man is produced. When the secretion is deficient, the body remains undersized. The internal secretion of the hinder lobe gives strength to the bowels and stimulates the kidneys. If the secretion is deficient, the carbohydrates are changed into fats and the body becomes abnormally fat. It also controls number of other glands such as thyroid gland, adrenal gland, testicles, 
and ovaries. The anterior lobe of pituitary gland makes and releases the following hormones, adrenocorticotropic hormone, acthocorticotrophin, stimulates the adrenal gland to produce a hormone called cortisol. Acth is also known as corticotrophin. Its functions including regulating metabolism, maintaining blood pressure, regulating blood sugar levels and reducing inflammation etc. Follicle stimulating hormone, FSH, and luteinizing hormone, LH, controls reproductive functioning and sexual characteristics. Stimulates the ovaries to produce estrogen, and progesterone and the testes to produce testosterone and sperm. LH and FSH are known collectively as gonadotropins. LH is also referred to as interstitial cell stimulating hormone, ICSH, in males. Growth hormone, GH, growth and repair. Hormone stimulates growth. In other words, it helps children grow taller. In adults, Growth hormone helps maintain healthy muscles and bones and impacts fat distribution. GH also impacts your metabolism. How your body turns the food you eat into energy. Prolactin, PRL, prolactin stimulates breast milk production, lactation, after giving birth. It can affect fertility and sexual functions in adults. Thyroid stimulating hormone, TSH, stimulates the thyroid gland to secrete its own hormone, which is called thyroxine. TSH is also known as thyrotropin. TSH hormones manage your metabolism, energy levels and your nervous system. The posterior lobe of your pituitary gland stores and releases the following hormones, but your hypothalamus makes the hormone, ADH, or vasopressin, Target kidney controls the blood fluid and mineral levels in the body by affecting water retention by the kidneys. This hormone is also known vasopressin or arginine vasopressin, AVP. Oxytocin, hypothalamus makes oxytocin, and pituitary gland stores and releases it. In people assigned female at birth, oxytocin helps labor to progress during childbirth by sending signals to their uterus to contract. It also causes breast milk to flow and influences the bonding between parent and baby. In people assigned male at birth, oxytocin plays a role in moving sperm, affects uterine contractions in pregnancy and birth and subsequent release of breast milk. Other hypothalamus hormones Hypothalamus also produces below hormones dopamine, feel-good hormone and gives a sense of pleasure. It also gives the motivation to do something when feeling pleasure. Dopamine signals the pituitary to stop releasing. Prolactin. Somatostatin. Hormone prevents the secretion of several other hormones, including growth hormone, thyroid stimulating hormone, cholecystokinin and insulin. In turn, all of these hormones control the production of somatostatin. Rest endocrine glands to be continued in next video. Thanks for watching my video. For more videos kindly like subscribe and share.